In just about 45 minutes, teachers and staff in the Geneva Area City School District are getting ready to strike after contract negotiations failed again last night. Their association contract expired in June. They haven't been able to come to an agreement on a new one with the new superintendent. Meg Shah is live there at Geneva High School this morning. Uh, interesting here, Meg, because the big sticking point apparently is not over money. Yeah, that's right. We talked to one of the teachers who is acting as a uh, representation for the Teachers Association, and she tells us that this all comes down to a disagreement on how the school district is handling remote learning. Cheryl Ramsey, a spokesperson for the Teachers Association, says negotiations for a new contract were going smoothly up until a new superintendent took over last June. And now Ramsey tells us they've been unable to come to an agreement about online learning. So this is heartbreaking, all of this. It's not something we wanted to do. The superintendent wants to continue with the option of teachers simultaneously teaching students online along with students in their classroom. Teachers instead want to approve the purchase of a separate online learning program for the remote students in the district. Imagine me trying to teach you about something and then having 24 students in my classroom at the same time and having them asking questions, it's not the best learning environment for the students. They suffer. The district superintendent tells us late last night negotiations lasted for six hours yesterday. Both sides trying to avoid a strike, but the board and teachers association couldn't come to an agreement. The board's offer addressed what has been their primary objection which was to not have to teach students both in person and online synchronously. Unfortunately, this was still rejected. We were willing to also extend the bargaining in order to avoid a strike. The superintendent also added, if the district shifts to remote instruction or a hybrid model, teachers will not be required to live stream to remote students while instructing students in person, unless the teachers association president and superintendent agree otherwise in writing. Now, even before Tuesday's negotiations, Ramsey says the community has been very supportive of the teachers, especially at the most recent school board meeting. The outpouring of support from the community has been tremendous. They want us to um, stick to this and to not back down. All right, so the Geneva Teachers Association represents 145 teachers, counselors, and nurses who all work in this district of about 2,300 students. So the strike is scheduled to start this morning around 7.30 now. Of course, that we're 45 minutes out. I do see some cars and some folks trickling in here, but nothing uh, organized just yet. So, of course, we will keep you updated on our News 5 app and on our website as well. For now, live in Geneva, I'm Meg Shaw, News 5 Trent.